Hello YouTube, welcome back to another episode of Excel Learning Series with Sayyid. To follow along with me, download this workbook using the link in the video description. There are two worksheets in this workbook, see it and do it. Do it is for you to practice, see it is where I will demonstrate this. Concatenate function, this function is beautiful, designed to combine multiple strings into one set. Now why would I need that? Imagine you have to produce a full name. Now you have your first name in column A and you have your last name in column B. They are two different cells. Now I need to combine them to show it as a full name. I have two methods. I can go ahead use the ampersand symbol or I can use concatenate function. Let us take a look. Now using ampersand symbol first. Press equal to on your keyboard, select the first name, then insert ampersand, then select the last name. They both should be attached to each other now. Let's press enter. We have them, but there is a problem. There is no space in between. How do I add space? Pretty simple. I go back, enter the formula one more time, press equal to, select the first cell, then ampersand then in between double quotations I will insert space now A3 is the first name we are adding this space to A3 and to this space we need to add the last name for that I need to insert ampersand one more time then select the last name and press enter on the keyboard there we go now there is simple method here we can use concatenate function press equal to type in con and you will see excel is already suggesting me functions starting with those letters select that function using the arrow key on your keyboard press tab on the keyboard to complete the function then we need to pass the arguments text 1 text 2 and so on for me text 1 is first name comma text 2 is the second cell that is the last name close the bracket press enter great they are combined but we have a problem similar problem that we faced in the earlier uh, method all we need to do is type in equal to concatenate function one more time select the first name insert comma this time insert double quotation with the space in between press comma then select last name close the bracket press enter there we go we can select both of these and double click on the drag handle now you know how to add multiple strings using the ampersand symbol and also the concatenate function hope you find this video helpful to do your day-to-day -day activities in Excel in case of questions do not hesitate to write in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel to continue your learning with Sayyid. Thank you so much for watching the video and have a beautiful day ahead.